Yeah. Well, welcome to the Flying Star Cafe. This is a, I guess that's a, yes, I, Dolores can say it's appropriate for this discussion because we're going off to the Flying Stars today. This is really an all-star cast of UFO researchers that have not been assembled hardly anywhere. I'm Alan Steinfeld for New Realities, and I'm very happy to be here because the film, The Hidden Hand, that James Carmen did was sort of an introduction to UFO research and technologies and ETs. And here we're going to go a lot deeper with some of these with the people here who have put their lives into this investigation. So let me just introduce to you who's here with us today. We have Clifford Stone. Who, yes. His work and his own contact with ETs is very important to understanding this next level of reality that people are about to embrace. We have the idea of ETs, the meeting these beings that don't really think anything like us is what I get. Their consciousness is different. To stand in their presence is to distort our awareness. That's I think my experience. So I want to get to understanding the mind of these beings, how we interface with them. What um, okay, what I'm going to be telling you now, it's going to be hard to swallow. But when I was very young, I had, uh, as you saw in the movie, I had these visits by what I thought was kids. The day I killed a little bird by accident, I was trying to save its life, I was only about six, seven, I saw one of these little ch uh, children as to what they really looked like. They wanted to know, or he wanted to know, why was I feeling like what I was feeling? In short, I didn't know it at the time, but one of those little children, which ultimately wound up being this particular entity, chooses people for life. In this case, he chose me. Throughout my life, they will monitor what I do. And it won't be what I want them to feel what I, uh, feel this or feel that. No, they actually learn from our life's experiences. When it comes to doing the interfacing, the government can't train this. They cannot train it. Not at all. Uh, they have to find the people that have that interface they don't find those people, then they're not going to be able to interface, uh, not with the entity. They have an attachment to the person that, and I use the term interface, that's the only term I can use, that they follow throughout life. And yeah, you're going to have people saying you're crazy and everything, but you know what? To deny it's going on is denying yourself. But if, if you have it going on, you know it's nothing to fear. And you've probably had those conversations between you and the person that's following or the entity that's following you. You need to tell your family though. If no one else, you need to tell your family. 